This video will demonstrate adding miscellaneous items to a project. So what miscellaneous items are, are items that you're going to create on a per project basis uh, that don't exist in your catalog. Um, you can add them to a project file and um, they are treated a little bit separately than other um, you know, items that are in the project in the sense that they are not taxed. So uh, to do that, to add one, go up to the new button and choose new miscellaneous item. This will open this form where you can create uh, an item for this job. And I'm going to say travel, travel time, Oops. travel expenses. Now, um, you can add quantities of these, um, a unit price, which will multiply by the quantity. You can also put a unit of measure here. So like maybe if you were charging mileage or something like that. Uh, in this case, I'm going to add a, like, you know, a flat fee for this job of uh, $300 for travel. Uh, no unit of measure there and go ahead and just hit save and now that's been added to this project file you won't see it here in uh, this particular view unless you scroll all the way down but you can always just go to miscellaneous items and you'll see that um, this is listed here within the project file now where they um, show up on reports uh, let's take a look at a proposal report here uh, we'll go to proposal and i'll just do uh, by location we'll run the report and Miscellaneous items are going to appear at the end after the project subtotal. So here's the all the the gear and labor and all that in a job. Here you've got your um, miscellaneous items displaying. And on the last page here, you'll see that the miscellaneous items are displaying um, you know, beneath the sales tax because they are non-taxed items.